Hey, thanks for checking out Montana Bible College. Uh, we're making this short video to help you understand a little bit about Montana Bible College's facilities. You'd be surprised, perhaps, how often we're asked, with the low tuition that you guys charge, do you operate this college out of a cardboard box or what? And uh, we'd like to show you around our facilities and help you understand that uh, MBC is a college that has been blessed with exceptional facilities. And uh, we'd like to take you on a brief tour, so let's show you around. So Montana Bible College was founded back in 1987 and at that point Grace Bible Church was meeting in a building downtown in Bozeman and they said that they'd welcome Montana Bible College to be hosted in their building. Um, that's just been a relationship that's continued since that time clear to the present. The two institutions, the, the church and the school, are not tied together in any official way. Uh, the church is completely separate and independent as a church and the school has its own board of directors. There's no financial dependence one for the other, but well, we've just got a really great mutually beneficial relationship. Uh, the Grace Bible Church building is available to our students in a number of different ways. There's a wonderful gym and there's a great weight room off of there and that's available to our students. And so there's basketball happening in there and different weight training activities as well as a CrossFit uh, exercise program. The worship center of the church building is uh, used occasionally by MBC. Obviously it's a little bit large for most classrooms, but it's a great location for our church leaders conference that we host every fall. It's where we host our commencement exercises every year, and so that uh, room does get used by our school as well. The youth room is a great place where we host our chapels every week. It's got its own sound system that's there all the time, and so our worship teams are ready to go and able to use that facility. The classrooms at Grace Bible Church serve dual purposes. On Sundays, of course, they're used for the church's activities, for Sunday schools and so forth. During the week, they're set up for Montana Bible College classrooms. They have permanently mounted projectors and all of the technology that we need for our classrooms. They've got small tables that are set up for the students, and so they really work well as classroom facilities for us. And there's a couple of those rooms that just serve 100% of the time is dedicated classrooms for us. But NBC's offices are the place where all of our students come and they can check their mailboxes, get their assignments back, they can meet with professors, they can conduct their financial business, uh, register for classes, take care of all of their student business uh, right here in one location. So a lot of students ask, well, are, are we required then to attend Grace Bible Church? Uh, the answer is no, you're not required to attend Grace Bible Church. There are a good number of solid churches in the Bozeman area and our students are spread out all around the Gallatin Valley doing ministry in many churches. Some students definitely do join and be part of this church because it's a solid Bible believing teaching church and it's very convenient for them. Uh, we really do want our students involved in churches all around the Gallatin Valley so that we have an impact in this community and a relationship with the, the larger church community. Montana Bible College owns all of our dorm facilities. Um, the ladies, men's, and married student housing is all uh, property of Montana Bible College. And uh, we don't purchase or build any facilities without the money to do so. Um, we provide really just incredible um, housing for our students that live on campus. It's a real blessing for them. It's really very economical. You know, we don't charge a lot 
for our students to live in in our dorm facilities. For the living on the Bozeman economy, our housing is very affordable. All of these facilities are located just off of the Grace Bible Church campus, and so it's really nice to not have to worry about driving in the winter to get to a school or that sort of thing. You know, it's just a walk across the, the parking lot. So it's very, very convenient. We've got a ladies dorm, and in that dorm we have um, eight apartments, two bedroom apartments. Um, they're wonderful facilities. We have a max of four girls per apartment, and they come fully furnished. And then we have also have a men's dorm, and uh, down on the main floor there are two three bedroom apartments and then upstairs we have three apartments as well that are two bedroom and then one one bedroom apartment and um, and then also we have a married student facility and there are six married student apartments in that in that building our married student housing is uh, located in Providence Hall and they are on the top floor and the bottom floor of Providence Hall houses our library. That too is a wonderful facility and we're very blessed to have it. Hi, my name is Jessica Carlson and I am library director at Montana Bible College. The purpose of the library is to support the curricular functions of the teaching faculty and to serve the students in their academic and research purposes. This building was generously donated to the Montana Bible College, so we now own this building. Uh, we were able to move in summer 2014 and we're set up and ready to go for students in the fall of 2014. Currently we have close to 15,000 volumes. To our knowledge, that is the largest theological collection in the state. We serve the students by being available for reference needs, being available to help them with their assignments or any research problems they're having. We try to develop a very strong theological collection so that they have lots of resources to choose from, both in physical form and in digital form. In the library we have a section of the library that's devoted to our physical collection. You can see behind me uh, we have a computer lab. And we also have a reference room that is a great place for quiet research and reading. Uh, we have several group study rooms that can be used uh, with other students or individually. We also have a student lounge where we offer snacks and drinks for students. We are also open to the public and we would welcome any visitors that would want to stop by and see our space. <laughs>